Hey, hey, happy people. So today we are going to be making some sour cream because I need it and another recipe that I'm going to make. So I already made my uh, Parmesan cheese and now I need to make my sour cream to go in this recipe. So let's just get this started. I'm using the blender cup today. I have, let me put the ingredients right here so you guys can see that. But I have one cup of uh, hemp seeds here. See if I can do this without spilling it. I have not been successful in the past. Oh, didn't make it. Alright. And I have a half a teaspoon of sea salt. I got one heaping tablespoon of sea moss gel. This is the raw one, not the cooked one. Two tablespoons of key lime juice. And I got a half a cup to start off with. Let's just say that. To start off with, I have a half a cup of uh, hemp seed milk. Now I do have more hemp seed milk waiting in the wings over here just in case I need it but we're just going to go with this first. I always start with a half cup and then add a tablespoon at a time as I need it. going to be a little watery, liquidy, fluidy in the beginning here until you put it in the refrigerator. Alright, so look at that. So it's all nice and creamy there. Looks like sour cream. Now, I'm just going to put this in the refrigerator. I don't need this recipe until tomorrow. So I'm going to put it in the refrigerator so it'll thicken up a little bit. And I'll show you guys uh, tomorrow what it looks like after it's thickened up. But until then, uh, well, no, not until then. Because I'm going to come back on this video and actually show you what it looks like after it's thickened up in the refrigerator. And I'll be right back. Video magic. Alright people, so it has been about three hours here since I have let my sour cream set in the refrigerator. And I just want to give you guys a close up of how thick and creamy it is. Look at that. Can y'all see that? That is creamy. Runs just like sour cream there. Alright, so that is it for my sour cream there. That looks so good. Um, okay, so that is it for the sour cream. Uh, give this video a like because now we have sour cream that we can use in our recipes to help make us alkaline completely. And subscribe so you can see more videos so you can see how I substitute uh, things in the alkaline lifestyle to uh, accommodate other recipes. Hit the notification bell so you'll know as soon as I drop a new video so you can see what my next video is. My next recipe is. The next video. So you can see what my next recipe is. Alright, and with that, you guys stay happy. Uh-huh.